Yeah, like, I, I gotta ask you this. Um, do you think that Trench's news really is doing this for Doug? Rest in peace, Doug, by the way. No. I, I, I agree. I ain't feel that, feel that either. Hey, 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 hey. You don't know, you know how I know he ain't doing it for Doug? Because. Who who else was he doing the mother informants? Is getting on the stand on the mother niggas for? Who's he doing that for? He don't know all them people personally. Facts. Okay. So so he want to use one of the places where he went undercover in person as a oh I'm not undercover informant I'm doing this because I knew them you feel me but whole time Duck ain't even really fuck with swipers so I don't know why he even putting that message out you feel me like he doing. Like, he, he doing this for money, twenty five thousand. You know what I'm saying? That's all, that's the reason that the last person, David Sloan, got on the stand and he was over like from BD. He, he did it for twenty one thousand five hundred fifty. So it's all about money. You feel me? A lot of these guys out here, they not seeing numbers at all. Well, I mean, if they not rapping, especially if they not a made it rap or they working a good, real good job. But I'd say a good majority of dudes in his position. They gotta do stuff like that to come up and make money. You feel me? Right. I have a question. Did you see um, David Salon post after he was outed as the informant? Did you see what he said? Oh, uh, nah. Hey, hey. I, <laughs> I, been, I was locked up with Lil Dave before. Me and him, we used to play cards, all types of shit. So, like, after I found this out, I stopped just looking at his shit. <laughs> <laughs> He well, he basically he's deflating it for sure. Okay, my opinion, he's definitely deflating it. Okay, you talking about when he was he's, talking about old oh boy, baby, mama, and stuff like that, though. Well, not even that part. The part about what he said, he ain't know nothing about no murder, da, 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 and like, bro, nobody said you did. They use you to provide the structure of O Block. Mm-hmm. You know, yeah. is right, that your yeah. wife that was on the video? Oh, uh, yeah, that's Ruby Legendary, the other the, hey, Ruby, the co-host. Uh, Ruby was trying to get her notes read out. You kept interrupting her. <laughs> hey, so... Yeah, my uh, bad, my bad. Hey, hey the reason that I was doing so much commentary on that one is because it's so crazy because... Look, I, I can't even call him Trenches. I, I call him Martel. Me and Martel were selling in Division 6 on P-Wing. This man got mad over the light, right? Because we used to have to, uh, we only had one light in our cells, you feel me? And when it was bedtime, if you want to stay up and read, you got to keep that light on because once the light go off, it's black in the cell. So, you feel me? I'm up, I'm reading. He, he didn't pulled it on me before when I told him to turn off the lights. He ain't want to do it. So, I'm like, right, I'm going to get this nigga back, you feel me? So, I, boom, I get to read. I had like some little urban novel. I can't remember what urban novel it was. But, and then the crazy part is, look, I'm on the bottom bunk. This man on the top bunk. So I'm already knowing if he get on that with me, you feel me? He gotta hop down first. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, so I'm right now reading my books like, man, turn the light off. Oh man, I'm reading. He man, turn the motherfucking light off. I'm like, nah, bro, I'm not turning no light off. Who want the band, bro? Because when you got the light on, and I tell you, you turn the light off. You don't try to turn that motherfucker off. He man, he get down like I'm sweet. He flicked the light off. I'm back up in the bed. I get up. You feel me? I turn the light back on. I lay in the bunk. Get back to read. He jumped down. He turned off the light. I stand up. I go back, turn the light. He stand up. He like, hey, man, so what, we going to play these games? He going to touch that light again. I'm going to knock you out. That's what he said to me, right? So, um, uh, oh, you going to knock me out? I say, I say, you touch the light again. I'm going to drag your head off through this cell from all the wall. He tell me, he's like, oh, yeah? Man, when I tell you this man do the most stupidest rush ever for me, he do some shit like. I gotta show y'all this shit. Uh, so, so, so basically, the man, the man do some shit like this. He said, he said, oh, yeah. You hear me? So, 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 hold on, let me put the camera in a better position. He's in the whole body, all good. So, the man, he, he grabbed me like this, he's in, he's trying to rest me. So, get your bitch head off, you feel me? So, so, while I'm punching him in the head, why the man bite me? On me, he bite me right here. 
trenches news because he tried to make it seem like he was just this this hard robber that everybody was kind of like feared of and it's like you know, hey. he owned that but he changed his life like the, the reputation that he claimed he had on youtube is that really trenches news in real life like the big scary robber <laughs> who, who he was in jail I can't say he was outside because in jail he was a straight chunk. You feel me? He was he, he was tattletale. And then come find out when we get outside, he's tattletaling. So I'm guessing that he's the same person that he was inside as he is outside because every little, you know, when he said, oh, I was right there when K.I. got killed and I was there when this happened on the block. I was there when this happened. Nah, you, you wasn't a part of what happened. You was doing interviews at the time. And this just coincidentally happened while you was doing an interview. That don't make you a part of that shit. You just have to be there. That's like saying where white men come with camera crews to do gangland and shit like that. They get shot at. Oh, they they gang gang now because they got shot at just because they was coming to do an interview. Mm. Right. I found a video of I can't, I don't know. It looked like it could have been um, FBG Brick, rest in peace to him, pouring water on his face while he was sitting on a couch. I don't know if that's who it's actually, but they singing like an FBG song. So to me, I was like looking at that video like he was the the goofy, like he was just the you know the pick the pick on dude that was around. Oh yeah, yeah, this man, that man, trenches ain't getting no gun until I guess he stopped being there for me. He had no way to get no gun, so for him to have a gun now. So I'm gonna have no money to get no gun. Hey man, so tell tell me this. What made you say that you was finna go to the courthouse and start doing giving updates? Like what like did you like damn that gonna be dope? Like you know what I'm saying? Cause I know you touched on it but what really made you like did you like I know I could grow my channel like this or you just wanted to really just put out the updates because you was in there and did you decide to go to court just to put out the updates or you was really wanting to see like what was going on uh no actually I was asked to do it I, <laughs> I, I was minding my business I was playing my playstation I prefer to be doing that <laughs> Right, right. <laughs> video making and all this shit hard as hell. <laughs> hey, okay, listen. So, so somebody asked you to go to the courthouse and, and sit in and then come out and give updates? Yeah, yeah, my manager. Yeah, he he our cousin too. My manager is my cousin, his name Reese. Uh his Instagram's FBG North L L D. It's FBG underscore North underscore L L D. But he basically feel what I'm saying. He's real, real close because he really kicking with Lashina all the time. I'm young, so you feel me? I'll be around young crowd. I'm twenty eight. So I don't know if that's a single young crowd anymore, but I just remember the days out there. Your, your knees about to start popping in a minute. You ain't <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I just felt like it was 2012 yesterday. I was like, <laughs> Shout out to Reese, though. Shout out to Reese. <laughs> so, you feel me? He asked me to come through and do it because I was going to go for the trial anyway. He was like, yo, you want to cover this because Lashin would do it, but you know, she's going through things right now. Are you down to do it? I'm like, oh, yeah, sure. So I didn't expect. You know what I'm saying? The feedback to get that it got. 
because I was just doing something for my cousin, you feel me? So when everything started going up with it, I was like, oh, that's nice because I wanted to do music, you feel me? So, you know, doing reports wasn't my thing. So when it was starting to become my thing, I'm yeah. like, now I got to stick to it, you feel me? Because I'm actually... It's you know, like, it's, that was a... Shout out to your manager, okay? Because that's how I connected with you. Like, it's it's the perfect plan because nobody else is doing it. Like, nobody else is doing it. Everybody was waiting for um, the news, you know, Chicago Sun-Times news. So for you to be in there, okay? And then you connect to, you know, to us, to everyday people. And on a, on a you know, wider scale with other cases, I do what you do. You know what I'm saying? So... To be there, cause I wanted to be there. I wanted to pull up, but the shit too. <laughs> I don't know. I might have to oh, creep yeah, in and creep yeah. out. Yeah, you heard. You heard, Lizelle. So my uh, brother got robbed right after he took the stand. He went to O Block trying to kick it. I guess I put out a video too fast. Hold on, hold on, hold on. His brother took the stand. Yeah, uh, uh, Montreal. Jose Osama, his brother, he basically... That's not his he, brother. Is huh? That's not uh, his brother. No, no they're not, they not, as, not as in, like, immediate family brother, but as in they super, super close. Yo! That must be what some other YouTubers got wrong. 